High dynamic range images generate a spherical, lit environment around your scene. They provide a robust background and at the same time also generate an overall illumination with shadows and full 360 degree reflections. An HDRI can be applied the same way as any background image. Select the one you like and drag and drop it into the preview window or directly into the thumbnail reserved for backgrounds in the inspector. The list of background types will automatically change and the HDRI icon will become active. This icon opens a dialog box where you can activate the light power emitted by the HDRI. As soon as the Use HDR Image Lighting box is checked, the preview refreshes and shows you the result. With the slider below, you can modify the initial lighting power by increasing its intensity, for example. The next slider controls the brightness of the image. Here, you can adjust the brightness up or down. To replace an already applied background HDR image with another one is very simple. Simply drag and drop a new HDRI into the preview and it will automatically be replaced. Activate the lighting for this new one in the dialog box and adjust the settings if necessary. This 360 degree spherical background works perfectly from all points of view, but you can also change the image's position compared to the camera. To do so, just hold down the control key on your keyboard and drag the thumbnail image to the inspector. Follow the changes in the preview and find the best position for your background. HDRIs containing bright scenes may sometimes still require an additional light to cast hard shadows. As a result, you can activate a heliodon for the view using the HDR image and use its direct lighting power only. The skylight and cloud editor will be temporarily disabled by Atlantis. The position of the sun as well as the direct light power and shadow casting remain editable in the usual way. For a good result, the parameters of the final rendering should be related to the parameters of your HDRI background. The smaller the size of the HDR image, the more pixelated the background will be. Download the HDRI samples from our website and try it out! <laughs>